Welcome to this Widex e-learning tutorial on setting up Compass. Compass GPS is your tool when fitting dream hearing aids. If you are new to Compass GPS or have previously worked with Compass 5, you might want to set up the program according to your preferences. When you start Compass GPS, the Session Start window opens. Click on Compass Setup under More Tools. This opens the setup window in which the adjustable parameters are categorized into six tabs. The first is the General tab, where you can choose software language. Whether the hearing aid battery low warning should be on or off, and whether Compass Improvement Program should be on or off. Select the relevant interfaces from the Available Interfaces menu and click Add. The Current Interfaces menu lets you select the preferred interface and below you can click Test to verify that the interface is connected and works properly. The Audiometry tab lets you set up the audiometric conditions for Compass GPS. Select the preferred audiometric measurement type, the preferred transducer type, and define the preferred normalized hearing level to estimated hearing level correction. RECD values. You can select the preferred 2cc coupler reference for RECD values. Transducer reference for RECD can also be defined. Fitting and fine-tuning is split up into four areas. Rationale, where you can choose whether vent compensation under ISA should be on or off. If bone conduction levels have been entered in the audiogram, you can define the way bone conduction data should influence the fitting. Fine-tuning. Define your preferred view of the gain matrix. Basic or expanded. Check the box here if you prefer binaural adjustments when fine-tuning. Sensogram. Set the sensogram measurement offset. By default, the sensogram starting points reflect the hearing threshold levels of the audiogram. You might prefer to start the sensogram measurement from within or outside the audible range of the client. You can also define the way sensogram tones should be activated. Acclimatization. Set acclimatization in the fitting to be initially active or inactive. Choose if the default acclimatization type should be automatic or manual. You can also select the preferred initial level and default duration for automatic acclimatization. The Graphics tab allows you to select the preferred graphics view in the fitting overview and the preferred graphics view of the program settings menu when fine-tuning, the unit displayed in these views, and the preferred display of target values. The last tab is Print, where you define two graphic views to be presented in the complete report printout. You can also define whether these graphics should be presented in DBHL or DBSPL. If you want your company logo inserted on the printouts, you can select the image file from here. If, for some reason, you need to return to the factory settings of Compass, you can click the Return button in the upper right-hand corner. 